Hi everyone, I just wanted to come on to show you um, in terms of how to do a proper squat and to be very, very conscious of, of how you are doing your squat so that you don't impact your knees. So there are a few things here that will really help you. First off, if you get yourself a mirror or something, wherever you're doing your workout, make sure you have a mirror so that you can check your form out. If you haven't got a mirror, if you have a window, I mean, I've got a window here so I can see my reflection in it to make sure that my form is correct. So that's just a few things, a couple of things I'd recommend that you do first off to make sure that your form is right. In terms of when, you, right, in terms of when you do a squat, what you want to make sure is that your knees aren't going over your toes and you're going down like that. Imagine you're sitting on a toilet seat. Very, very nice. Imagine you're sitting on a toilet seat and you're going down. You're keeping your knees behind your toes. Let me just a bit more. So you keep it, you're not going, you're not going down like that and your knees going over your toes. Your knees are going back. And as you come up, you squeeze your glutes, your butt cheeks. Okay, so as you're going down, you're not doing that. One of the ways to make sure, as I said, is to make sure that you have a mirror or something that next to you that you can check every time, especially when you're lifting weight because you can sometimes be focusing more on the weights than on your technique. And it's making sure that you get your technique right first off. So if that means going to lower weights until you get your technique right, then so be it. Just make sure that you get your technique right first. If you've got any questions at all, please, please, please let me know. And I hope this helped.